Hello. I am back. Once again. Bobolatru. We won with the yellow deck last time, huh? What else we got? I think I've played every deck so far. Or like, since the game came out, I think I've played uh, three runs and played the first three decks. So I'm kind of down to keep going down the list. Green deck. At the end of each round, you get $2 per remaining hand, $1 per remaining discard, and no interest. Okay. Somewhat economic based. Uncommon joker. Hmm. If I could afford it, it would be good. But I'm not going to be able to afford anything with four bucks. So I think I just have to play. Also, the way this deck works, it like incentivizes fighting. Wow, this hand is good. Oh, I remember I have to change the setting. I saw someone do this. And I was like, this is, is great. Uh, I might speed the game up. Well, no, four is too many. High contrast cards. I think this looks sweet. We speed it up. I'm scared. No, okay. That was a placebo. <laughs> I didn't fully pay attention. But basically, this deck wants to win. Play rounds, win hands quickly. Oh yeah, this looks so cool. Look at these. Look at these sets. Look at these colors. Uh, wants to win rounds quickly. Because both discards and hands remaining gives you money. Extra money. I think you still get the money for hands. And you don't get interest, so you want to spend all your money. I'm down for this. I like this voucher a lot. Letting you planet stack. I do need some mold. Buying this random joker is good. Three of a kind. And, and fours are good. I might be able to build around this. If nothing else, I think it's a reasonable multiplier. Did not even check what skipping did, by the way. Ooh. Hogging. We're just popping off today. The base hands are good. Which is really good for this deck. Interesting. You don't get the mon extra money for hands. So I guess this deck really says remaining hands are now worth a dollar extra and you get money for remaining discards, which you don't normally get, but you don't get interest. Ooh. I mean, definitely going to buy this. Three of a kind is currently my most played hand. Well, that's not true. It's full house. Full house and four of a kind. Wow. What a start. This makes me want to get kings. This card's really good if you can enable it. I kind of want this three, actually. I'll play a full house. This king seems fun. Running out of discards, but it's okay. Oh, I thought I hit some shenanigans. That was mid. That's okay, though. It'll get better. So the bad thing is, I don't make money if I don't have hands left. Which is a real shame. I feel like the kings are actually the only thing scoring. So I'm gonna play all these cards. And if I have to play the king later, I will. Okay, I lied. It turns out when you multiply very little, you don't get very much. Shocking, I know. All right, we barely made that. And we made no money, apart from the boss money. Yikes. This wants me to add kings to my deck. This wants me to add tens and fours to my deck. This wants me to play straights. This wants me to skip booster packs. I think I'm just buying cards, right? I will pay slightly less money. Kings are good. Sure. Just don't really know how I'm going to 
scale right now. Dupe looks fine. I have a king. Yeah, no chip multipliers are really bad. Can't help but feel like... I was going to say, did I play two pair before? I think I did, actually. That wasn't good. Never mind. That hand was way better than the one I just played. Need ten... Uh, crud. <laughs> Maybe this? It's pretty bad. Oh, we're just basically looking for another hand. Oh boy. At least 10. I think this is good enough. I hope so, because it's all we have. Alright, nailed it. Well, that actually won on its own. <sighs> the money situation is real bad. This is good. Wish I could buy both of these. I don't think... Well... Buying... No, this has to be better than buying a card. This basically makes a specific card for either of these. I will buy Joker. Good old Joker. <laughs> Six bucks? I mean, I think I need money. I gotta try and win. Is this straight good? I hope so. I'm playing it. This 10's gonna help. Oh yeah, Fuego. All right, so when you play good hands, it gets better. I think I want to try and make more kings with this death than make more tens and fours. I think we're probably not going to do walkie talking for all that long. Plus 20 molt if the hand is three or fewer cards. We could play a bunch of three of a kinds, I guess. I think this is good enough to buy now. Also, this joker actually helped, I think. The basic tutorial joker coming in clutch. Oh, I like this card a lot. Yeah, this scales with a bunch of other jokers. None of the ones I have, unfortunately. Can't make interest. Do I want this? I don't think so. I do have one extra joker slot, actually. So if I sell one of my jokers, this will just keep making them. I think half joker is better than riff raff. I think I'm not going to spend my money. Obviously I don't make interest, but I have nothing else to do. Oh, this is kind of cool. Each discarded six. These are face cards. These are different face cards? I guess maybe not. this wow that is actually ridiculous I uh, could play three of a kind for the half joker malt probably good don't know if death is good I think I still want to try and make kings does this trigger if I have a king maybe double up flush I guess I can hold on to it two eights right yeah I'm trying to think. Something like this. Sure. Oh, this looks better. I think this is better. Oh. Okay, yeah, that was good enough. I didn't do the fiery thing, so I was like, oh no, was it really bad? But. The first hand made enough money that I think it was okay. I didn't use this. What am I trying to build? I want to just like add a bunch of kinks to my deck and go off with Baron. 
That's my plan. I don't know how good my plan is. And that plan, Jupiter, not that good. Although I think it's, it's only worth a dollar. I think it's better to leave it. Uh, Mail-in rebate's pretty good for econ, and I do kind of need extra econ. Eight ball is kind of whatever. Sellable, I would say. I think I'm keeping rebate, selling half joker. Oh, I guess that's the other thing. There's a bunch of jokers that scale with joker creation. I'm looking for that stuff too. I think I'll buy this. Sprint, oh. I know what this is, even though I haven't discovered yet, because uh, I have been watching YouTube videos, which is pretty rare. Usually for games I'm playing, I don't watch that much content, but this is the kind of game where it's so expansive that watching other people play is pretty satisfying. And I don't think it really ruins your experience. DNA, uh, oh yeah, this is perfect. So every time I play a king, I'll get another king. This is exactly what Baron wants. Also, it gives you the card back, which I think is one of the reasons this is really good. Uh, I will take the voucher. Seems pretty important, especially given that this wastes in air quotes. Uh, this wastes a king. I don't think I need walkie-talkie anymore. Although I could potentially get a bunch of tens and fours. Maybe I'll keep it then. Just mail-in rebate is not the one. Kind of a weird situation. But I do want to keep making jokers. It's kind of weirdly a way I make money. So, I want this. Uh, I think I do want this. Because I want to spend my money, generally. Two pair seems fine. I think it was worth taking a random planet there. Oh, I have the voucher too. So most played hand, two pair. Okay. Not surprising, I guess, if I'm trying to make 10 4 work potentially. I don't think I can skip ever. Egg. Oh, April came back. <laughs> the kings, that's good. Oh, I need to trigger DNA. Yes. Nice. Ooh, 33. It looked good. For a minute there, I was like, oh, it's cooking. And it was not cooking. I'll play this 9. I don't think I need it. Unless the 9 is going to become a king. Question mark? I think that is what's going to happen. Yes. Alright. We have begun the king scaling. This makes a planet card because we got 8 ball back. Don't want to make anything a molt card. Yeah, I could make this king a molt card. Does that make anything? Not really. That's kind of lame. Unlucky. I don't really know what I'm playing. Just four, maybe? Yeah, I guess this four. I just play this full house. Sure. I'll make these malt cards then. I guess we are in on the 10 4 thing for now. Kind of weird, but whatever. Should do something. I'm cooking. This doesn't trigger, unfortunately. Oh, that didn't actually cook that hard. Kind of unlucky. I think the scaling will be good, but it's a little weird right now. Getting egg is good, though. It's basically, it's like getting $5. Oh. Well, then. We have discovered a strategy. <laughs> Yeah. Once again, I want to sell all my things. I think I'm going to sell Walkie Talkie. I'm... Again, the planet cards feel too bad to sell, basically. <laughs> Jumbo Buffoon. And this scales. This kind of scales. This scales. This scales. I kind of feel like I'm there. I guess the Arcana packs are good. Can make more lucky cards, potentially. Makes a joker, makes bonus cards, stone, malt, death. 
Could make another king. That is helpful, but... I have a lot of spades, weirdly. Other, every other suit is the same. I guess all my sweet kings are spades. Okay. Um, I have a couple... Well... Doesn't really matter. Make this heart a king, I suppose. I'll make it a king of spades. None of these make lucky cards, right? Yeah. Make a king. Or kinging. This is, uh... Yeah, I don't know. It's a weird one. Don't want to buy this. Next round. No spectral pack. Flushes and diamonds. Lucky cards. I do want to play this. I need to make lucky cards for lucky cat. Which means I am going to finish by trying to find many kings. I have nine kings in my whole deck, six left. Diamonds, flush. I don't really care about these, but we'll move them over. Because if I do care about them, I will want them to be over there. Let's go. Two pair of aces and kings? Eh, yeah, we can do better. This looks better. Okay. Oh. Lucky king triggers. Never lucky. That. That was really bad. I guess I don't have any malt when I play kings. Is this good? It seems bad. Like, what am I supposed to play? Maybe spade flushes? Didn't get there either. Let's just play El Pair. Nope, I didn't make any points either. Oh, this should be good, right? Surely. Surely this will be good. No, it's just not enough malt. I need like a million kings in hand for this to be enough malt. I think this is a lesson in misunderstanding like chips versus malt on the scoring axis of the game. Also how like this and this did not interact as favorably as I'd hoped. Specifically because the lucky card I wanted to play was a king. This also isn't doing anything currently. I have to trigger the lucky cards first. I have to play a hand. This king didn't do anything, right? I think it's just over. But this is my best lost hand. Sad. Hmm. I was excited for some of the things happening in that run, but I don't think I navigated very well. I don't care about the boss blind. Again, I feel like one of this deck's big early strengths is early game, so definitely want to play early game. I don't want to keep. I think those sevens were it for me. We're just fishing for this flush. is not going to be that much extra money, unfortunately. But it was enough to win. It's actually a good amount of money. Oh, I love Space Joker. I might try to upgrade though. Let's get this Joker. Seems fine. Open this. See if this helps us give something to build. 
Space Joker around. Fool doesn't do anything. Wheel of Fortune for the memes? Kind of down for Wheel of Fortune for the memes, honestly. Let's go. Plus 50 chips. That's pretty good. Especially early game. Skip for Uncommon Joker. Well, I'll have no money, so that doesn't work for me. What hand am I trying to upgrade? I guess it depends what I get. I don't feel like I'm really locked into anything yet. So once I have... Like, this scales well, but I need to figure out what hand I want to play. We're just looking for Broadway or Full House. So close. I mean, it's kind of the same discard as before. Oh, never mind. I don't even need the nine. That was one of the reasons I wasn't going to do this. Definitely want to play the highest value hands I can find. This foil, by the way, that extra 50 chips made a huge difference. Oh god, this card. This card would have been really sick if I had Riff Raff again. Don't think I want to try and take Knife and Scale. Guess I could just open this. This is also pretty good, but kind of expensive. So buy it next. Makes it Taro when discarded. I could get something going. Or we could take one of these gold cards for a bit of econ. I think I'm here for this eight. Making tarot cards is a way to scale. Must play five cards. Got it. Uh, this is a six or a jack. I don't think I need the four. Yeah, because if I hit the six, the four will work. Oh, we're so close. No, I don't need this five. <laughs> don't really need this king. Just need a jack. Or the other end of the straight. Guess I don't need this stuff. Oh, wait. There's a flush in my hand. That's probably just better. That's probably good enough. Again, the 50 chips going to do a lot of work here. I think one of the things I realized thinking about and watching more Balotro lately is that I'm very obsessed with the malt side of the game because it's a way to obviously take your big numbers and make them really big. But both sides of this equation matter, which isn't surprising. When the goal is to output the biggest number, size of your number will matter. Free money, nice. Oh, seed money. Oh, I can't make interest, never mind. I always see this and I get so excited, but this is like the one deck where you can't get excited. Wily Jokum wanting to make three of a kinds, maybe. It's kind of an interesting way to scale through the early mid section of the run. I guess I'll open this buffoon pack first. See if this gives me an idea. See? All right, well, I think we have discovered what we're doing, for better or worse. We're going to play two pair as many times as possible. Might still buy this, actually, though. It's not too bad. I can play two pair and three of a kind. But our jokers say those are the hands we're playing, so... Those are the hands we're playing. Five of spades. So, if we're playing two pair and three of a kind, we could just take this eight. We could take any of these enhanced cards. I don't think just taking an eight makes sense. <laughs> I'll take this. Well, any of the enhanced cards, really. Maybe taking eight is good, actually. Whatever, we'll take it. The honest answer is I don't know. Two pair. There are many eights in my deck, as we have just established. The pants, they scale. We gotta really scale these pants. What's left? Uh, 
Three aces, two kings, three queens. Two sevens, three threes. Bunch of fives, bunch of sixes. So this stuff isn't as good. I don't know if this makes sense. I don't feel like that made sense. Three tens and three queens and three aces, but I kind of have to pick. I'm just trying to pick. I should pick from... All the cards that are worth more, right? I think this triggers two pair, right? Sorry, triggers. Spare pants. I think so. I think it worked in the demo. It does work. I mean, yeah. I think it. Oh, it triggers this too. Oh. That's interesting. Okay. So, we kind of have it sorted. We want to play two pair, three of a kind, or full house. Full house actually is the best of all of those, which I didn't even think about. This is decent scaling. I don't think we need the Celestials. Also kind of just need to buy a card for the sake of it, right? Kind of feel that way about buying one of these packs too. Like saving some money is okay because if you spike something expensive, it's somewhat worthwhile being able to buy it. But especially since sometimes this deck just doesn't make money, that seems kind of good. This is, yeah, this is malt for everything, just gains malt as you play. Two pair. Kind of down for this. Ooh. It's kind of crazy. Seems good, right? Sure. Oh, two cuts. We have five threes and eight, six eights. Everything else is normal. Three dollars when the cut is played. I think that's better than the other decon one. The full houses. Doesn't look like it. Oh, I should have played an extra card probably. Or whatever. The hook is dealing with that. Nice. Made a lot of money on this round too. Game plus four chips. Played hand has exactly four cards. That is supremely interesting. I think that's better than... Well... Man, this might scale so hard. also seems kind of good because we're playing two parallel we might have diamond club heart spade a decent amount some of the time we can maybe engineer our way there we have a good mix of suits though i kind of like it i'm gonna sell this i'm gonna buy this i think i'm gonna sell this and buy this so we've kind of exchanged our flat chips for chip scaling and we picked up a flat malt rather than uh I guess this is flat malt this is multiplicative malt I don't know it's very confusing go with this I think this is better first maybe it doesn't matter don't really care about flushes in fact kind of actively don't care about them these are good This becomes the same cut, right? Yeah. Becomes the same suit too. Don't know if I care about this. 
think I do care about this. More eights, anyone? I guess I'm down for more eights. I don't want to upset the balance too much, though. I think playing is good. Hmm. Nice. Could make these aces gold. This will trigger this, right? Wait. Oh, it's held. Okay, I want to make a bad card. I want to use this at the end, then, basically. Well, this hand might win. Sure, we'll make this a gold card. Then, don't think we want to copy anything. Diamond club, spade, pot. Diamond, club, spade, hot. Yes, this will not trigger this. So I could trigger that. I guess I don't have Wily Joker anymore. But I think that's actually good. Because I do need to make this as good as possible. Diamond, club, hot, spade. Alright. We're scaling. One of the weirder double pants builds I've seen in a while, but... We might be cooking. Should have made an extra gold card there, I think. Just to make money. I don't think death is getting much better than that. The planet card use. I could also see this being good. I think we are feeling it with flower pot though. Crazily. Hmm, interesting. They're all spades. I guess if I open another planet card enabler, maybe constellation becomes more interesting. I think I took a three already, right? Yeah, I did. Take another three. I think we'll skip constellation here. Upgrade full house by three levels. That's actually pretty good. I think I'm okay to pass. Diamond, club, art, spade. Those aren't spades. I will play this though. They're doing to upgrade the square joker as much as possible. It was a half decent hand. If I hold on to this and make a planet card. Let's hold on to it. This is not Diamond Club Hot Spade, but that's okay. We're upgrading our things. The pants are going to the moon. Could copy this, make another planet card. Is that even good? It seems okay. Seems fine. I guess it can also be a pair I play too, if I need it. But we're pretty much all in on this two pair situation. Space Joker triggering is good. Let's have a direction. Ooh, that was pretty good. Made some planets, nice. Full house, we will upgrade. More of a kind. Uh, actually maybe. Well, we're gonna use them. Again, selling the planet cards doesn't really feel worth it, so using them seems fine. They do make a pretty big difference. We want this, this is, oh, just not the last time I can get this, right? Uh, I can get it after this. Do I want this? I don't think I'm playing straights. Okay, we'll take most of this. If not all of it. Mars. These are not the best. Guess I'll just use this. Didn't really like those other options at all. Open this. Tens. I have a normal amount of tens. But it's an enhanced ten, so that's fine. Buy this. This. I think we will just buy it. Do I want to sell this? I could use this first, I guess. Now that I have the space. Unlucky. Might actually want to sell it then. Alright, we'll go next. 
gonna need to try and get some value out of this hermit. Cards drawn face down after each hand played. What? Oh, this is a to be fair. It's not Diamond Club Hut Speed though. Did I just have that before? I think the f extra four wasn't there before. Oh goodness. Oh goodness. We just gamble. <laughs> I guess I always get Square Draker triggers. That was not good. Space Draker saved me. Wow, that was way better than I feel like it had any right to be. Space Tracker Trigger again. Yeah, that was enough somehow. I kind of just blinded my way through that and it worked out. I'm very surprised. Seems good. I think I have to cash in my Hermit now. I wanted to make more money, but I think I need to spend some money now. Namely buying all this stuff. Could have sold this Mars actually. I think that was probably correct. Two, four, or a stone card. I think we're skipping. Kind of savage. Yeah, I think this these would have been better as four dollars. Selling them. Two per upgrade actually would be good. Guess we'll keep taking Earth. Don't want to play four houses, but. There's a world where we can. Diamond club. Hot spade. Nailed it. <laughs> this is really good still. Kind of set for two per scaling, I hope. Oh, ew, let's go. Oh. Didn't even think about that. Nice. Rich. Damn, not the hermit. Kind of happy with my jokers. I guess this juggler could be something different. But I don't think I want to buy a buffoon pack to find out. Oh, I remember. I was like, I was thinking about something. Because I was like, I need money. And it's because I'm trying to buy the joker in the next shop. Because I'm going to skip the middle blind, I think. Fours and threes. I have six threes and four fours. Kind of down for this holographic four, I suppose. I think we just use these. Skip. We'll use them when we need to. Diamond club hot spade. Club. No. Damn. Hot. Uh, wait. Diamond Club Hot Spade, right? Diamond. Why is this so hot? Diamond. This is way too hot. Diamond Club Hot Spade. Yes. That's actually way too hot. Nice. Gives me gold if I hold on to it. Guess I'll just use these. Guarding this gives me a tarot card. I have a lot of eights in my deck. But I don't think I care about either of these. I think selling these will actually make sense. More eights. Fishing for more eights. Probably some looking I can do here. 
Oh my goodness. You hate to see it. I think I might just play this for the money, actually. Oh, there's two there also. Exactly four cards. Doesn't have to be good. I just want the money. I think this is worth it. Oh, that was actually enough. Poggers. Some, sometimes it happens. Alright. Give me the sweet hollow joker. I mean, it's negative. Oh yeah, it was a negative. That was the whole reason I wanted to buy it. It was basically free. Basically. Guess I'll buy this voucher. Vouchers generally are pretty good. Especially because this deck reasonably makes ten dollars pretty consistently more eights wild king i have six kings i think an extra king would be good also it helped me trigger flower pot i think plus 15 alt zero discards remaining big pog jumbo celestial shore there i'm a simple man don't think I'm using these. I guess I could use them to... It's a lot of money. Oh. I could skip, skip, and then play the head. That seems alright. I'm kind of here for it. I don't know. I just, like, love negative jokers. Which, I don't know if that's a problem. But... How I, how I think... I do need to play hands. More upgrades. It's gonna be very hard to trigger flower pot. In fact, I think it's actually impossible. The numbers in my deck are very weird. <laughs> It seems like this is starting to scale more. How many kings do I have? Four left, allegedly. That's a lot of kings. Four kings, five eights. Queens, I don't really have any. I have two queens. So I just leave them. This is a pair, I guess. I could really keep this. Yeah, like this, if I'm not going to play it. Oh, that's so close to something. Do I want to play this again? I think so. This might be dicey. It wasn't that dicey. And yeah, not getting this malt kind of sucks, but I think we're okay. Do I want to play a full house here instead? 60 times 4. Oh, yeah. Definitely want to play a full house here. I think this is enough. Oh, I just have plus 15 malt too. Okay, nice. Kind of not ideal because we're playing with a deck that wants to play a small number of hands. And a lot of my cards want me to play more hands. Like this wants me to, this makes my final hand good. Or if I discard first, it makes all my hands good. Oh, that is sick. I'm trolling. Wow, I lost myself like, so much money there, actually. Whoops. And I could have sold these, too. Yikes. Look away, children. <laughs> Misplays are happening. What would I take out of my deck? I mean, I'm going to use the Hanging Man, but... Maybe just on a five? Is that insane? Doesn't seem that insane. I think I want the other cards. I don't know. That was weird. I think reroll is good though. Pluto. I do play high card sometimes. 
could reroll again. It's also not bad. Is this better than... This is 100 chips always? This is 50? I think this is better than that. The sell value also is the same. So I think this is good. Three. Oh. Death is good. This doesn't seem... Oh, it seems okay. I don't care about common jokers. I have a lot of jokers. This makes chips. Should go down here. Wants me to just discard clubs. And I do want to use all my discards. But... Do... Hmm. Okay, actually discarding this seems too good. I'll keep the steel card. Oh, I don't have room. Ugh! I'm dumb. Don't have a club. That's okay. Pants square joker. 28. That's a lot of malt. Doesn't seem that good though. Could copy this 8. That's actually kind of good. How many threes do I have? I have some weird number of threes, right? Six threes. What about nines? Five nines. I could do without a nine. Although, I kind of need it right now. Maybe I just wait? The malt's good though. Oh, I could make a card. But yeah, this is where I was going to actually use these. Okay, so what hand do I want to play? I'm going to play this. This is missing a spade. Yeah, that doesn't work. How many threes do I have again? Six. Eh. How many aces? Four. I feel like making an ace. Steel eight. Doesn't line up for me. I think this three is expendable enough. Could also just make this eight a steel eight, but I don't think that's the plan. I think I will play this though. Oh, I should use my discards too. Well, whatever. I have to discard clubs. Yeah, I need to also do that. To play this card. Discard. Yeah, I do need to do this actually. This? It has a score, right? It has to score. Okay. Score away. High card stonks rising. That was not that bad. Oh, it actually was enough. <laughs> Alright, so I need to pay a little bit more attention to Castle. I'll take the tarot cards. These ones aren't great, but I think the other ones are good. Make spades, make planet cards, destroy cards, wild cards, hearts. Hangman is just not that interesting to me. I think Priestess is fine. Yeah, sure. Some of the stuff that's happening feels a little anemic. So I do want to buy this. I think leveling up two pairs is actually important. It's kind of my only way to win. Straight flush, full house, flush pair. Well, I guess technically I could also do this. But it wouldn't be as good. Well, actually that's not true. I just need to play four guard hands to level up Square Joker. Don't actually have to like do anything with them. I guess standard pack. Meh. Can I reroll the boss blind? I think that was last run. What suit is this? Diamonds. Thank you. Thank you, me. Actually checking my cards for once. Is four of a kind also two pairs? I'm gonna say yes. Doesn't count as two pair. Kind of feel like I got scammed. It was pretty good though. Diamonds. These aren't diamonds. Astute observation, I know. Kings? 
two left queens two left aces <laughs> two left okay tens same two left guess I'm trying to hold on to this maybe hit the ace of course this should be fun this is such a weird bit of scaling it doesn't feel like enough but maybe I still say diamonds but I'm out of discards so kind of out of stuff to do I guess I'm gonna play this I don't know if this is actually good It was good enough. It's starting to feel like a lot of hands are feeling good enough, and that's not the best feeling. 10 4. You have one extra 10 or 4. I don't think I care about that. Still care about Arcana Packs, I think. Money? Sure. Yeah, I think this is good enough. More kings? I have a bunch of kings, right? Yeah, I have eight. No, a nice normal amount of kings. Probably should have rerolled there. I don't understand why this is bad, by the way. Hearts. Discard hearts. Start with this. That was just okay. Didn't draw three cuts. What? Oh, I see. It's not draw three cards. It's only draw three cards, not however many you draw. Okay, that's actually pretty bad. Diamonds and clubs I can make. Okay, do you just have to play this? I need to find a way to trigger flower pot to win from here. Yeah, it's looking kind of sussy. You can make diamonds and clubs. I have hearts and spades. No, I don't need diamonds. Diamond, club, hot spade. I need to make this a club. Diamond, club, hot spade. This might not be anything. Kind of sussy. Yeah, that's bad. Oh man. We're dead. Okay, the serpent boomed me. I feel like I really, I feel like I really tried to cook this video. Not successful. Uh, yeah, Bellatro. Still a really sweet game. I think I didn't quite get the grasp of the strengths of this deck. Like, there's definitely some moments where economy feels really good, but it also is very different. And I think without having a more normal economy, even though it did end up with a decent amount of money, just did not navigate the early mid game very well. Anyway, always fun. There'll be more Blotcher on the channel. I'm having an absolute blast with this game. I've actually considered it playing uh, off camera just for fun, but instead of just been watching videos. Speaking of watching videos, if you enjoyed this one, leave a like, comment, and or subscribe if you're into that sort of thing. Otherwise, there's more videos coming. And as always, thanks for hanging out.